Hi everybody, it's Linnea here for Ink on 3. Today I have a really special project to share with you. I'm going to be creating a set of cards for my son's teacher. And I'll be using some Atelier inks along with a, a stamp and a stencil combo from Tailored Expressions. So this is the I Pick You combo. And this comes with a rubber stamp, which you're going to see me stamp here, as well as a detailed clear stamp. So let's get started with my set of cards. I have a sticky grid mat inside of my Misty, and I've put that I Pick You rubber stamp onto the lid of my Misty, and then I'm going to line up my piece of cardstock so that I can be sure that this is going to be centered on my card background. I'm using Blackout Hybrid Detail Ink to stamp the I Pick You background, and it's just going to give me these apple outlines. Now you can definitely go ahead and use markers or pencils or whatever you want to color these in, but what's really fun about this I Pick You combo is that there are stamps to fill in the areas, which is going to make this set of cards come together really quickly. I stamped a total of six backgrounds with those apples. One is going to be a card for my son's teacher, and then five I'm going to box I'm together as a little gift set for her. Inks to add all of my color into my apple backgrounds. So right now you see me going in with goddess green and I'll fill in all of the uh, apple leaves. And then I'm going to use a combination of goddess green, Maryland red, marigold orange, and bee sting yellow to add some fun details to the apples. So for this first background here, I'm just using this kind of outline that's leaving the center of the apple blank and then I'll fill that in in just a moment but I'm just kind of randomly stamping my background I'm spacing these out so that I don't have two of the same color right next to each other although I think in the end I do have to put two reds right next to each other but that's okay I don't think anybody will really notice I just did my best to try to space these out a bit so while I'm doing this because this is pretty basic I'm just going to go ahead and keep stamping with those four um Atelier ink colors as well as using some blackout hybrid detail ink for my inside details. I thought I'd tell you why I'm making this set of cards. My son is in kindergarten. And this is his first time in any kind of schooling or daycare system. So this is his first time with a teacher. And I joined the PTA at my son's school. And right off the bat, I noticed how hard teachers work. My son is only in kindergarten and she works hard every day to make sure that they have fun activities. She has this system of goals put in place where if the kids exhibit good behaviors they get to what's called clipping up on the behavior scale and my son comes home every day so excited telling me about the sticker that his teacher gave him and the words of encouragement that his teacher has given him in just three weeks He's learned multiple letters of the alphabet to recognize them, to write them. Um, he's learned so many numbers already. He can write his name. These teachers work so hard. And so I thought that I would put together just this little set of gift cards for her just to say thank you. So I'm moving on now with my cards. And in this I Pick You set, you there's a stencil too. And you can go without it. But I thought it'd be fun to add these little stripe details in here. So I placed the stencil over my background. I used some purple tape to hold this in place. And now I'm coming in with peacock blue ink and just inking this up and creating lines in between my apples. So some of my cards I use peacock blue. Some of them I use paint black. And some of them I use twiggy brown just to vary those backgrounds a little bit. Each one of these cards is different with different centers stamped in the apples and with the color of the background. So each one of these is different, but they are all a cohesive set. I'm just going to add some finishing touches to my cards now. I thought that I would go simple with a die cut sentiment. So on the card that I'm actually going to give my son's teacher, I'm using a thanks die. This is the Simon Says Stamp script thanks die. And then on the cards that are part of her little gift set, I'm using the My Favorite Things Sweet Hello die set. And then the words underneath the little sentiment, those are from that I Pick You clear stamp set that I used to stamp the centers of the apples. So here are all of the cards. That first one is for me to give to her. And then this whole set, I have stamped and created this cohesive little mini note card set. 
and I found five red envelopes in my stash and they matched the Marigold Red Atelier ink almost perfectly. So I found five of those envelopes and I have a clear box also from Tailored Expressions that I'm going to put all five of these envelopes and cards into and package them all together and I have this fun little gift set to give to my son's teacher. So I hope you've really enjoyed this project featuring the Ink on Three Atelier inks. Thanks so much for watching you guys and I will see you again soon. Bye. Thank you again very much for watching this video. If you liked this video and you'd like to see more from me, please hit that subscribe button that is on the screen now. And here are a few other videos that I thought you might enjoy.